Uh, Tiernan, 2-1 defeat here at Anna, not, not the result we wanted, but how did you see the game overall? Um, really disappointed, to be honest with you. I thought it was a very lacklustre performance. Um, it's probably the first time that we've had to go in after a game or even at half time and talk about a, a, a lack of hunger and a, a lack of desire and and I felt there was a little bit of a lack of both in in the first half and the, then obviously the sending off made a difference. We're not going to make excuses about that. We still should have had more about us. Um, but disappointed, yeah, disappointed. In terms of the story of the game, we uh, scored a good goal, put, got ourselves 1-0 up through Andy Scott. Um, I suppose at that stage maybe you're hoping to kind of you know things will settle down and we'll we'll maybe start to take the game to them a little bit more. But maybe that um, equaliser early in the second half sort of rocks us a little bit as well. Yeah, listen. The, the the truth of the matter is, Ian, that we just didn't do enough. Um, over 93, 94 minutes, we didn't do enough to win that game. Um, and and if truth be told, even in the first half, they had two or three really really good chances that they should have done better with. Um, and it was a really off night for us. Um, obviously, we made a lot of changes, um, gave people chances tonight. We got some of the younger boys on the pitch tonight, um, which will will stand by them. You, you learn probably just as much and more sometimes from from games that don't go your way than what you do from from games that do go your way. Um, but we'll make no excuses. We, we we will hold our hands up and we'll take that squarely on the chin. And in terms of sending off, it seemed a little bit of a strange situation with two yellow cards flash very quickly as maybe did the next 10 minutes or so where yellow cards were coming out the referee's pocket very uh, plentifully. Yeah, I, I was disappointed in Jamie w w with regard to that sending off. Um, and I, I don't think there was anybody in the whole ground that, that had a reaction that there, there was a sending off or there was an incident there that deserved to be a sending off. And nine times out of ten, you can always tell by players' reactions. As I say, I'm not going to use this as an excuse. It's not an excuse. Um, I thought it was a poor decision um, and, and I told him that after the game um, but it was what it was People maybe watching on or um, following on Twitter would have seen sort of flurry yellow cards that came afterwards it maybe would have seemed like a team that lost their composure but it didn't really look like that from watching on the sidelines seemed that um, sort of every time we were penalised it was, it was a yellow card Yeah, as I say, I was very disappointed in Jamie's performance tonight um, I was very disappointed in her own performance so I'm not going to stand and make excuses but um, I just it, there wasn't really a bad tackle in the game. Um, I think there was definitely frustration in our part that we, we kind of never really got going. It was a bad night at the office. There was no real rhythm to what we were doing, and probably a little bit of frustration kicked in. But I don't think they warranted the yellow cards or the sending off that that that, that, that followed. Is it matter now? I'm trying to draw a line under things very quickly and move on to Yuri and, and continue the good form that we've seen this season. Yeah, listen, uh, we, we made a lot of changes tonight. I think uh, there was nine changes in the team tonight. So, um, But that's what squads are about. And you have to get rotation and get minutes in people's legs. And um, we will we will get over it very quickly and, and, and start looking towards Saturday. Friday, sorry, I should say. And is it good to have a game maybe so, so quickly off the back of, of a night like this that you can try to uh, sort of put things right and get out of the system? Yeah, I think there'll be a lot of regret in that changing room um, and I think there'll be a lot of regret when people put their heads in their pillows tonight that they, they could have, should have done more, could have worked harder, could have got that tackle and could have got beyond the, the different things that run around your head after games. Um, but there, there are things that we have to learn from and it's our first little bit of adversity this season and we have to get over it and learn from it and uh, put it behind us. Great, thank you. Thank you.